fictional story. Shakespeare in Love must recreate a very real image of Elizabethan London, and that represents an exciting challenge for designer Nick Ormerod. I think the challenges of Shakespeare in Love are very clear in that we are trying to bring 1593 London alive and with all its range of people from, from prostitutes up to Queen Elizabeth and that's, that is a challenge. Our approach to playing Shakespeare has tended to be from the springing off point of making it accessible to a modern audience and playing it in modern dress. In this case um, we're playing it in period costume and as accurate as we can, give or, give or take a few liberties. There's no modern reference in the costume at all, so we can allow the audience to go into that world. In an, and in a sense, it's the text and the wit which will give the modern resonance. It does offer modern audiences an opportunity to go into that world, not at all as a historical recreation in some museum way, but very much mediated by somebody who's um, an incredibly important modern playwright. It is a challenge, but then you have that huge range of, of, of possibilities. The people, of course, of London of that time range from the extraordinarily rich um, to the very poor. People in late Elizabethan London wore their wealth in their clothes and every inch was decorated with jewellery and rich fabrics and the clothes were the most valuable part of their possessions if you like. What we have to do is we have to do things like Nick with the set. He's got to articulate a space in which we have the court, we have um, backstage at the theatre and we've got front of house at the theatre, we've got the auditorium of the theatre and all of those things are very very difficult to do, to do elegantly, simply and without having long darknesses between scene changes so that we can have that fluidity which is the essence of Shakespeare's plays. We're privileged in that we know a little bit about what the theatre was like and we have very good recreations of the Globe Theatre and that's that is the springing board for um, our concept for Shakespeare in Love. It's based within the theatre of the time and um, we hope to recreate that rumbustious atmosphere. We do need to uh, move very seamlessly from the court to the theatre, to a tavern, to Viola's household. And um, the joy of theatre is that we can do this in very simple ways and hopefully the audience will be utterly engaged that the smallest thing um, will spark off their imagination. Ultimately, we rely on the imagination of the audience, and that is the magic of theatre.